Hi everyone, um, the Xtrouble team has been working on Xtrouble 2.0 for the last six months and I thought it would be nice to give you a short overview of what's new here uh, because we're just very excited uh, to have a beta out now that you can try out yourself and uh, uh, give a spin. So what's new is a feature we call application profiling that gives you an instant overview of where time is spent in your application code when a request happens. Uh, uh, in your uh, servlet container. Um, so this is what it looks like. You can go to the beta page, download it, but let's take a quick look at uh, what happens when you use that feature. So I've got Jira running on my machine locally here. Um, so I issued a, a request to Jira. You can see the Xtrouble toolbar to the left side here. Um, you still see the familiar icons uh, for those that have already been using Xtrouble 1. Um, here you've got obviously the IO uh, entries which show you, for example, what queries were done in the database. You can click through and, and see the details here, but let's not dive into this now. Let's go into application profiling. And you can see that this one request actually was composed out of six GET requests and one POST request. Um, you can see the time that was spent when uh, executing this request. And when you expand this, you can see a very understandable breakdown of what actually uh, took time to execute this request. So obviously the first method, which is uh, part of the container, the Tomcat contra the asserted container, took 100% of the time. And then it's broken down. So site mesh took 99%. And then it is basically split up into two different sections. So one where it actually is rendering the header and the footer, and then the actual main content area. You can see that here with the packages to the right side and actually see which is taking up most time in your application. Um, there is another feature here. So if I expand this tips section, which is, um, I don't know, an, an embedded request that renders tips in, in, inside that uh, main page. And you can see something else here is that we've got hot methods, which uh, by themselves take up a long time to actually um, execute. And in this case, this is actually preparing a SQL statement. So and it's taking up 80%, 18% of that request time. Um, so if this request would have been a slow request, which in this case it isn't, it's only uh, running for four milliseconds, but if it would have been a slow request, then you can actually see that particular area and say, okay, this is almost taking 20% of my slow request. It might be that method that I need to tune. And you don't have to peruse any data to get at this. You just issue the request and Xtrouble shows you exactly what is going on. Um, uh, let's look at another one here. So this is uh, another request that came in and it shows you how it's actually going through all the fields that are being rendered uh, to generate HTML and actually going through um, bean serialization here. Um, interesting stuff to look at. Um, let's let's click through here and let's, for example, um, go to the main page of Jira. You can see that it's very responsive running on, on my local machine. Um, and I can see what is going on in this main page and all these requests are there. Um, I can go to the dashboard and see what the dashboard is composed out of. I can see that it's rendering some velocity templates. Um, again, that tips method, that tips request is here doing similar stuff. Um, so that is application profiling in Xtrouble 2.0 beta. Uh, you can take a look at it today and we'll have a beta for a couple of weeks uh, and then the public release of Xtrouble 2.0 will be in the beginning of April. Um, hope you like it and do give us feedback if you have some. Thank you. Bye.